If you've ever traveled before, you're probably gonna find yourself in that situation where you're trying to haggle and get the very best price on buying some type of souvenir. But what would happen if you went the other direction and kept raising the price? I think it's perfect. I would totally wear it. All right. I like this because uh, every time I go to Thailand and Vietnam, this is what the streets look like. Pretty awesome. Uh, excuse me. How much? How much? How, how much is this? Whoa. Two hundred eighty thousand. Why so much? Big size also. Oh, you charge more for big shirts. <laughs> this is the only place in the world. No, you tell me. You tell me what you want. Wait, why? Mm, Three fifty. Three fifty. No, three fifty. Okay, fifty. You don't want three fifty? Yeah, no, okay. Four hundred. Four hundred. You might be Okay. I'm joking, bro. No. You I I already said I already set a price, now you say a price. I said three fifty. Now what's your price? Okay, two hundred. Why why are you going lower? That's two hundred. Four hundred. Oh my god. Four hundred. What happened? What's wrong? Four hundred. What's wrong with you? What's your price? Show me your price. I said four hundred. Which one's yours? I know. You, I see. I moved the price. Now you have to move the price. I said four hundred. You're saying. So what's your best price? Two hundred. Four fifty. Oh my god. Four fifty. Final offer. Take it or leave it. Okay. You want? Okay. 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 What happened? Dude, you are you are rough. You are. You're, 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 you're kind of a crazy negotiator. <laughs> you're kind of wild, dude. Here, do you take half a million? Keep the change. Keep the change? Yeah. Oh my God. Keep the change. Keep it. No, you keep the change. Thank you so much. I don't want change. Do you need to change? No. 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 Why not? Thank you. What's your name? Two. Two? Yeah. My name's Chris. Yeah. I like the shirt. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have a good day. Yeah. <laughs> You're like that crazy American. Twenty bucks. Yeah. Here's the problem. Here's the problem. I, I'm in the market and I run into this guy and he's like, Shh, hey, secret. In the marketplace, make sure you offer less than half. And then at most you gotta come up to oh never more than half. You gotta get the best deal. I'm like, dude, I've been traveling all over the world. When you start going third world to these different places, dude, this is how these people make their living. And so I, I used to do that. I used to like, I wanted to get the best deal I possibly could. The reality is I'd start feeling sick inside. Like, dude, I think I just saved $2 or 50 cents. But to us, you know, it's just, it's not a lot. So why not share? Why not give? Why not help? Why not, you know, for these people, man, if I, if I stay in a hotel and someone's, I'll never forget this actually. Um, this is Wayne Dyer, who's passed on. But I was listening to one of his audio programs and he talks about whenever he stays in a hotel, the maids that clean his toilet, he always leaves $100 tip. And it made such an impression that the people that are doing some of the hardest work are sometimes paid the least. Our teachers in society, dude, these people need to get taken care of. And even though I really don't know these people on the other side of the world, why not do just a little small kind deed that says, hey, a little bit of extra money certainly goes a way longer way for them than trying to save an extra buck or two. So check out my new awesome shirt. <laughs> I kid you not. Like so, I go to I, I, I go to Thailand for the first time, and like I'm ducking under these power lines with like a thousand power cords going through, and it looks just like that. So Vietnam Telecom, I'm gonna rock this shirt out. Yeah. <laughs>